You've heard public health officials and myself say many times that we need to flatten the curve or plank it. Earlier this week, President Trump and the CDC announced their 15-day plan to slow the spread of COVID-19 across the nation. And this afternoon, we're announcing new guidelines for every American to follow over the next 15 days. As we combat the virus, each and every one of us has a critical role to play. Every Canadian has a role to play in planking the curve. I'm asking Iowans to take a lead role in the president's 15 days to slow the spread plan. When a lot of people get sick in a short period of time, the curve rises faster. If too many people become seriously unwell at one time, the NHS will be unable to handle it, meaning more people are likely to die, not just from coronavirus, but from other illnesses as well. So it's vital to slow the spread of the disease. That's why we need to urgently slow the number of people getting infected. That's why we need to flatten the curve. You've said we can do anything for 15 days, but, but give it to us straight. Isn't this going to be longer than 15 days? How long do you think people should expect to be at home, essentially? Well, what you're talking about is our 15 days to stop the spread initiative. We're telling people that we really want them to avoid gatherings of 10 or more. We want them to avoid any unnecessary travel. Uh, we want them to work from home, if at all possible, or not go in. We feel like if we can get America to all pitch in for the next 15 days, we can flatten the curve, which is a term that you've been hearing a lot, not overwhelm our health care systems. So and 15 days is this. enough? 15 days is likely not going to be enough. Now... The 15 days that we had of mitigation clearly have had an effect, although it's tough to quantitate it because of those two opposing forces. But the reason why we feel so strongly about the necessity of the additional 30 days is that now is the time, whenever you're having an effect, not to take your foot off the accelerator and on the brake, but to just press it down on the accelerator.